I'm over here stroking my Never, never fucking dig straight tunnels. Don't forget, your enemies can also use your tunnels. If you dig a straight tunnel from your base to an objective point, and they take over that objective point, well, just, just fuck now, aren't you? So, add some variety to your tunnels. Mine up a bit to the left, mine up a bit to the right. It doesn't matter to be gay, you, you're fine. You don't need to dig a straight tunnel. Just don't give your enemies a free shooting range. It doesn't have to be anything fancy and hard. Even just typing up how many enemies are on in the objective point after dying in the team chat or telling your teammates with which objective points are better to go to is plenty plenty helpful which actually lead to the next tip if the enemies are constantly fighting for an objective it's an amazing idea to go for the ob other objective points that isn't fought for don't be afraid to get on an objective point to claim it uh, especially if you're an officer, like how else will you be able to win the game? If you see an op opportunity to do so, always go for it. Your tickets are always ticking down, don't forget about that. I've seen a lot of people do this, don't play too scared. If you forgot, you respawn at max 45 seconds. If someone's locking down your tunnel, you can just Rush them and trade kills because they will be pushed back and you will get to the objective point faster. You don't have to fear for your life and blaze and play 
absolutely carefully unless you have zero tickets or play FUCK! Or barely any left trying to run back to base. It's never bad to sacrifice your life to take an objective unless there aren't any teammates around to secure it. Check your resources. Really though. Check them. Check them. Check how much ammo, stems, if you're a magician, medkit, uses or rock supplies you have frequently. No reason not to and it would benefit you to not charge in a fight with zero ammo and just overall zero supplies. It's really useful. Know your weapons, your class and your perks. It's already quite obvious knowing how your gun and its hard fire works so don't even have to be explained. Same with your class, mechanics and perk usages. This also means that you should mostly be using your weapons on what is good at, such as, such as the shotgun in close range. Stop! Stop! Stop it. Stop saying my soul that scream! Or anything to that fucking effect! It's getting old! Oh, that's all! Blood! Blood! Charging isn't even good most of the time! You're just for you wasting tickets for the toilet team! <laughs>